Tonight, prosecutors in Palm Beach County are deciding whether to appeal a judge's ruling throwing out the hidden camera video in the prostitution case against NFL owner Robert Kraft. CBS 12's Chuck Weber has been following this story and joins us live at the Palm Beach County Courthouse with why one attorney believes the state will appeal. Chuck? Liz, as we know, Robert Kraft was due here in court next week, but now the whole case against him is teetering after the judge's video ruling. Hidden camera video from inside Orchids of Asia Day Spa in Jupiter formed the crux of the cases against New England Patriots owner Robert Kraft and 24 other men, all accused of soliciting prostitution. Jupiter police also lodged prostitution charges against the day spa owner and staff. But the judge presiding over Kraft's case just ruled Jupiter police failed to comply with established legal standards in conducting the surreptitious recording, mirroring an earlier decision in Martin County, Palm Beach County Judge Leonard Hanzer determined police did not take adequate steps to avoid recording legal activity at the spa. The principle called minimization. I think first off there's 100 percent chance the prosecutors are going to appeal uh, the judge's ruling. Patrick McCamey, former homicide prosecutor, now criminal defense attorney based in West Palm Beach. The state is going to argue that that Mr. Kraft was not a proper aggrieved party uh, and didn't have a right to minimization because he was actually there committing a criminal act in the spa. But if the judge's ruling stands, the case against Robert Kraft is ravaged. At that point, attorney McCamey says prosecutors would either drop charges or try to convince the arrested spa workers to cooperate. How bad do they really want to get the big fish? Um, you know, reality is these, these women are charged. They do not have to cooperate. So Robert Kraft has his calendar call set for next week, but today the judge said a status check in this case for the end of the week. We'll see what happens. Live in West Palm Beach, Chuck Weber, CBS 12 News.